Hi, Chris here for Tenka Tech and welcome to the channel. And in today's video, we will learn how you can play PUBG on your PC for free. So let's get started now. We first need to open our favorite browser like so. So we can go and download what we need. And that is PUBG Mobile, the official emulator which will allow us to play game on our PC for free once installed. In the browser here, you go and do a search for game loop and you can now go to game loop PUBG or copy and open the link hereafter provided in the description of this video down below. And if you do so, proceed to step 3. If you are doing it on your browser, you can choose the first link here. But note, if you do, you will have a few more things to read as well as more steps to do as this is the official website and will redirect you to the link that I posted for the PC website. So it is recommended to select the PUBG Mobile link here down below. Here at the top of this page, you can, if you want, select your language style here. Then again, for me, it was automatic and I stick with it. All we have to do now is to click on the big red download button here. Note that the download is really small. It's around one megabyte. You can expect this to go really fast. Okay. This is done, we can now locate our download. You should know where it has been downloaded, usually in your download folder, here. If not, just select this, and you will open the folder. Just right-click, run it as administrator, if you want to. But, for us, it is here. Then, on this file, click once, and this opens this new windows here. You can select install, but we will select install options, because I want to change the folder where this is stored. You can leave it, of course. I click browse. For me, at least, I will go to games. This is where I like my games to be. Or I can create a folder if I want to. And then, once I'm happy with the selection, I just will select OK. And this will bring us back to this window, when we can continue. We then select to agree with the install. Note here that depending on your PC configuration, you may encounter a few moments where nothing happens. If it's the case, simply minimize the browser and be patient. If you see nothing starting or happening here, please wait for some time in order for this file to initialize file to install. This is normal. Don't do anything. It will start automatically. You may grab a coffee or a bite to eat. Or eat to bite? I'm not sure. <laughs> There is nothing wrong with your PC, so don't go and throw it away. And at the bottom here, you notice there is a progress bar here. We have to wait for this progress bar to reach 100% mark. It's just that the game loop is being downloaded, as you can see here. And when it's done, it will initialize and install game loop, which is the official emulator. Wait, because the setup, it is not done yet. After some time, and you should be able to see this window here. You can choose here, either if you want or not the shortcut on the desktop. By clicking here. The other option is to click on Start and wait for the new window to open. Hopefully, this will allow us to install the essential updates needed for you to use your Game Loop emulator and, of course, for playing your PUBG mobile. This will give us another download. As you notice, you can pause if you want for this time the game itself and then you can read this. Let me know in the comments down below if you want more details on this. But right now, I will fast forward as there was over 10 minutes of footage where I explained what you can do and uh, go through the library, but I will spare you. While this is happening, notice here the two new icons that has been created on your desktop. The first one is for Game Loop, and the second one is for PUBG Mobile. Depending on if you want to play PUBG Mobile here, click on this. It is a shortcut for the app. This will initialize and you will also be able to see the system requirement minimum and the maximum recommended. So for the minimum, it is Windows XP with 2 GB of RAM. But actually, the recommended spec, and I will advise you to have this at least, are for Windows 7 and above with 8 GB of memory. You can read more if you want for the graphic cards. Yes, we are downloaded PUBG Mobile. And once we finish downloading, a new window will pop up, like so. Here, you can read it if you want, disagree if you don't want, but you will exit the setup, of course. I advise you to accept all, but I show you if you want to accept one by one. You have two windows to accept two. Then it brings you to this windows here. So here you have to agree to the policy and say that you have read. All right, you can also click here for the user agreement. Now you can log in with those social media, but I will choose more and select play game. But as you can see, there was other options if you want to. This is the login video. I will key in my info and uh, see you once uh, this is done. Here we are. And now this page actually is to ask you if you want to merge uh, this phone number that you use with this account. You can do yes or 
No, I will skip for myself. You have to agree to this. You have no choice anyway, but you can read following the links, the terms. This one here is for you if you want to back up. Okay, I disagree with that. And then after select agree, you may pause here if you want to. And here you have the options. You just have to read them. It is up to you what you want to toggle on or off. And then you just have to press on create. So here, it's a funny one because you don't have the choice. They ask you if you want to merge this with your account and uh, if you want to share the personal info with the other players, so on and so forth. There, you do whatever you want, right? You have to click on allow. I'll show you what happens if you click on denied. Like this, you don't have to. You have to redo the whole things again, right? <laughs> As you saw, we go back and do the same things again. We are almost done, don't worry. But this time, please click on allow, if you want to play the game, that is. You can see that the game is loading. And yes, you still have to wait a little bit. Here, you can change your setting if you want, as this is just for the demo. I leave it at 720p. Uh, we can put this as a full screen here, if you want to. And I'll show you how long it takes for it to compile the resource. This time, I will not speed it up. You just have to be patient. I will not do a gameplay as well. If you want me to do a gameplay or to play together, guys, just leave me a comment down below and I will be glad to do so. Just keep in mind that there may be a time difference since uh, some of my viewers are either from India or America. Uh, there is even a few of you from Europe uh, and thank you for that. But know that I am very happy actually. Anyway, we are almost there. Be patient. This also will depend on your internet connection, of course, and uh, your PC capabilities. And for your info, the whole recording for this video took about 45 minutes. This includes, of course, me going through different windows and things that I do not show in this video. That's why I ask if you want to know more about the settings and the window that you can expect to see and what to do, as usual, just to let me know in a comment down below. Because I'm not sure you want to see the full length of the video, but if you're happy with it, it is not a problem for me to do a video. I just think that a 34 minute video on this subject is not worth it. But then again, what do I know about game? All right, don't despair. We are almost there. And there we are. Yes. I know we have another loading screen. So here you can choose your region. Okay, I will uh, stick to Asia because this is where I am in. Click continue. And here you can select if you want a male or female character, as well as a few more configurations, such as the faces here. I will take this one, the hairstyle. Let's uh, pick this one up. Yeah. And a different hair color. Let's see. Um, I'm not sure which one. You can tell me which one you will have chosen for yourself if you want to. Uh, all right. For me, yeah, I think this one is okay. Here, if you click here, you can select your avatar or use a default. I will use my logo. And for the flag, as you can see, you have a very, very long selection of flags. That matches your country, you know, or if you want to use any. I will uh, choose the Yemen one for no particular reason, except that this is just a demo. Okay, in here, you can put your name. And then once you've done your selection, simply click on create as well. Loading here will be very fast, as you can see. And then you can select just OK if this appears. Another selection here, this time for your outfit. Once you select it, they just simply ask you to enjoy and press OK. So let's do that. Yeah, that's what we got. That's nice, isn't it? <laughs> OK. Now we have to click on the inventory. Select the items, uh, and uh, we can close that. Okay, we can start. We can load the mission. And another loading screen. This time, this one will be a little bit longer, as you have to perform a few security checks, like apparently check if you have anti-cheat if you also have banning and uh, so on and so forth. And note that if this can be circumvented, I do not condemn them at all. You can move freely on Spawn Island while you wait to board the plane. This basically is the pre-match screen and uh, you can roam freely here. I need a weapon. I need a weapon. I will fast forward. It would be good if you can find a weapon. I'm sure you can, but since it's for a demo, just uh, browse a little bit. I will exit here anyway. Uh, sorry guys, I'm sure that uh, one player less is not good for your team, but hopefully with this video you will get more. That is all for today. 
So you know you can do your YouTube things, like if you want to. It will be greatly appreciated if you subscribe, if you want to be notified every time I post a new video. You can even press the bell icon. However, if you do not like this video, simply leave a comment down below and tell me why you do not like it so. I will try my best to make it even better. Stay safe guys and bye now!